Hi there and welcome to this video. We want to look at five reasons why it's great to be a statistician. We start right out with reason number five. The best thing about being a statistician is that you get to play in everyone's backyard. A lot of industries need statisticians, so we get to look into a lot of things that other people don't get to see. Who said it? No one less than John Tukey, a famous statistician. Let's move on to reason number four. You never have to be right, only close. Isn't that great? Let other people deal with the so-called truth. For us, it's enough to deal with probabilities. I don't know who said it, but I assume the statement is significant, even if not in a statistical sense of the word. Reason number three. Estimating parameters is easier than dealing with real life. Well, what can I say? Especially if software does the hard part of calculating the parameters. Again, I don't know who said it, but of course this statement is also significant. Let's get more serious. Reason number two. I keep saying the sexy job in the next 10 years will be statisticians. Who said it? No one less than Google's chief economist, and he should know. He even explained this very well, saying that if there are two goods and one good is available in abundance at very low prices, and you need another good in combination with it, and you have a monopoly on this other good, then you're in a very good position. And this is more or less the situation for statisticians. What is available in large quantities at low prices or even no cost at all, virtually, data. And what is scarce? The know-how to really draw conclusions and get valuable information from this data. The quote is a few years old, but less than 10 years, so we should be in the middle of the golden age. So let's enjoy. And move on to the top reason. Number one. Statisticians are equipped with a powerful weapon, calculating means. Well, now, you might say this sounds a bit dull and boring, so let's look at an, exa add an example. Suppose a hunter tries to shoot a rabbit. He misses once to the left and once to the right, so it's just bad luck for the hunter. Not so for the statistician. He draws out his powerful weapon, calculates an average, one miss to the left, one miss to the right. On average, you get a dead rabbit. So it's as simple as that. Well, however, you know where there's light, there is also darkness. So one last thing. Let's look at the dark part. Calculating averages. This weapon is so powerful, it might tempt you to misuse it. One last example. Suppose the government hires a statistician to see how well people are off. So the statistician finds the following distribution of monthly income. Four people earn $1,000 per month and one person earns $996,000 per month. So a quick calculation shows total sum is $1 million divided by five people. So the average income comes down to $200,000 per month. So the statistician concludes People are very well off, um, they're really rich, the economy is doing fine and the government can be re-elected. If you work like this, then you can be assured you have fallen to the dark side. So don't say you haven't been warned. Well, stay significant and thanks for your attention.